Hello dear Capricorn and welcome to your June 2023 readings with me. If you're new to my channel, please do subscribe. So let's get started. <coughs> Sorry. This is what happens when you eat chocolate before. <laughs> so let's get started to see what's in store for Capri Sun, Moon and Rising this month. Well, your month starts with a roaring energy. You are full of energy. You are ready to take on the world. You are back in action. You are really, really dynamic. So a lot can be achieved by you, my dear Capricorn, in the first week. When it comes to your work, for Capri students also, you will have lots of energies to study, to get things done at this point of time. So it's a very good time to set your things in motion, my dear Capri students. Then when it comes to your uh, relationship, my dear Capricorns, at this point of time, you'll be really, really intense. Maybe you are deeply in love with someone or if you are single or you are, uh, you know, craving for somebody's company at this point of time. And uh, it's like a kind of a deep bond you feel with someone. For some of you, you might be, uh, if you are in already established relationship, you might be very, very aggressive towards your partner because uh, of that excessive energy, that excessive intensity that you have. So my dear Capri, just go slow. Don't be too, you know, uh, demanding from your partner. Just give them a bit of space because I see that you can become very possessive also about them and uh, uh, that can create a bit of um, you know disturbance in a relationship because in relationship we always need space okay too much closeness is not good also it's suffocating and the relationship can die because even a plant you know uh, it needs to grow it's like uh, love is like a tree you know or like a plant it needs to grow so it needs space to grow right if all the time is that closeness too much of closeness can create problems also in a relationship so give each other some space okay in the first week and i also see that um, money wise you will be doing quite well because that energy that you are uh, having at this point you can use it very well to earn more uh, to uh, some of you might also get some offer uh, of job like on the side where you can earn more money also and you will be really like highly motivated to do something like that also this is what I see to get some side income also is what I see for Capri's in the first week however my dear Capri's uh, take care not to get into any corals because there there will be a tendency to uh, become you know a bit aggressive or quarrelsome at this point of time i also see that those capris who are having blood pressure problems uh, should now take a lot of care okay especially the high blood pressure uh, because you might face uh, this because of this excessive energy you might uh, feel unstable also so just be calm and you know balance is the key word here my dear Capricorns okay so if you are interested in changing your life in having a dream life in manifesting a life that you want my dear ones so I have made a manifestation class this is a seven day class and I invite you all on this manifestation class as a child I was always manifesting and I didn't even know that this was called manifestation I used to just get what I wanted just through those techniques that I will be sharing in this manifestation masterclass with you all and I'll be sharing my techniques over there and also the spiritual side of manifestation that I feel nobody speaks about and that is extremely important to know my dear ones. So the link is given below and I invite you to this manifestation masterclass then we go to the second week and it's such a beautiful energy here my dear Capricorn here it's like the mothers of the universe the the divine feminine is blessing you at this point of time uh, whatever you were facing problems regarding a relationship regarding work regarding some administrative problems also regarding your paperwork for example and for students also regarding their 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 studies uh, their school or whatever problems with their friends that they were facing in the second week know that you are going to be 
protected my dear Capricorn because I see that there is the divine feminine energies which are protecting you and that doesn't mean that you go and jump into anything okay uh, in the second week uh, discrimination will be called discrimination in what sense the good from the bad okay you have to see what is what not how you want it to be because many a times the big mistake we make is we see things like the way we want them to be like for example a job from far it looks like wow this is the kind of job i want but then finally it's not that oh this is the kind of person i want because you have projected so many things and finally the person is themselves is not what you want them to be okay so just be careful about that just know what is what before jumping into anything uh, my dear capris in the second week your finances will be protected then i would almost say over here that keep a diary uh, this month and whatever you dream of at night just write it down okay because in the second week i see that there will be some kind of uh, downloads from above that is going to come in your sleep through your dreams you will be you know uh, guided on certain subjects or certain situations is what i see my dear capricorns and if your mother is not on the earth anymore is she's in another realm now she might want to communicate with you through your dreams also so take note of that what is she trying to tell you at this point of time because that can be something really really important my dear capricorn your health will be protected also so so no worries about that you are under the divine protection and things are really you know uh, going well for you in the second week is what i see and i also see if you're traveling and all also you have a strong protection upon you so don't worry okay and then we go to the third week now capricorns are back to work some of you are back to work while some of you are uh, changing your workplace your office your bureau whatever Uh, you are changing the workplace okay the place where you are working or you have been transferred from one place to another or one department to another also uh, this is the possibility in the third week for you my dear capricorn sun moon rising and i also see that capricorns are going to be a bit reflective you know reflecting on things um what makes them feel at home is going to be a question also for some of the capris uh, they are investing in a new uh, residence for some of you and for some of you you are selling uh, your inherited property most probably it belonged to your parents your grandparents uh, a house so so you are a flat and you're sell- selling it um at this point of time that is in the third week for some of you you are renting a holiday home somewhere and you are going there in the third week of june is what i see uh i see capris are not so much in a competitive mood in the third week of june i see them more um how can i say you know they just want to feel at home they want to take it easy they want to just you know navigate smoothly through all the waters that are presented at this point of time the kind of a sea that is in front of them they they don't mind if it is a turbulent sea or if it's a smooth thing they they just want to sail through it and they are not making any uh, efforts to you know just be very you know like worked up by it they are taking it easy that need to feel at home is very high in capris in the third week is what i see and for capri students you might be going back to school for some of you for some of you you are going to a new place where you are going to learn some extra uh, new skills also is what i see here while some of you are investing in a property a house a flat this is what i see and uh, yeah in the third week my dear capris please take care of your structure your bones okay uh, because i see that there can be some pains uh, that you can have like arthritis rheumatic pains can start in the body so just be careful uh, regarding that okay immediately consult the medical practitioners and then we go to the last week and here you are dealing with a 
feminine energy and how is this feminine energy well no and who is this feminine energy this feminine energy can be your teacher my dear kp students this feminine energy is very intelligent this feminine energy can be your uh, rival competitor at work my dear kp the feminine energy can be you yourself who is very clever who is very intelligent and who knows how to deal with things but then she keeps her interest first okay and uh, it can also be a potential partner at this point of time uh, who is uh, who is a kind of a workaholic i would say uh, and uh, who is pretty business minded uh, kind of a person but at the same time uh, she is you know mm, she knows what she wants okay and that means you come later <laughs> okay uh, for her you will not be the priority her work will be her ambition will be her priority is what i see in this feminine energy it can also be a lady from um your uh, administrative bureaus or some kind of uh, you know workplace where you're working or an administration office or a bank also a banker a lady banker also who you are getting in touch with in the last week it can be somebody from the medical field also but i see this more as a feminine energy uh, my dear capricorn and um, there can be some uh, hidden stuff here in the last week especially my dear capri if you are seeing somebody else out of your committed relationship then this person can be your ex partner or your ex or somebody like a third party this is what i see over here my dear capri is and just be careful because <sighs> if you are the other woman you will always remain the other woman okay just keep that in mind my dear capri women okay just digest or try to analyze what i just said okay so in the third party situation in the last week try not to get or rather get out of that third party situation because you are not get, going to get anything positive out of it uh, that is what i can tell the capri ladies over here and the capri gentlemen also i can tell you is that uh, honesty always remains the best policy no matter how bitter the pill is uh it has to be served okay because you can't live a life of lies okay or somebody if somebody does that to you you are not going to like it so if you are in a third party situation just make things clear and uh, you know make your decision which way you want to go you can't be with two people at the same time you can't be with everyone at the same time right because you're just one person so take care of that in the last week my dear capri uh, because i see that um, there is definitely this kind of an energy also that is revolving and for some of the capris it can be your ex partner who is contacting you it can be regarding the charge of your children and the charges uh, you know or some kind of uh, wants to create some kind of conflict this is what i see so deal with it in a stable capri mind with a stable capri mindset is what i can tell you my dear capris okay so thank you very much for listening please do like share and comment and i shall meet you next month until then take good care of yourself bye bye god bless bye